Hi and welcome back to Finding My Online Biz. My name's Keith Alchin and today we're playing with lighting. Right into it. Okay, so today I'm trying to light myself a little bit. Um, I've got some cheapy lights that I bought a number of years ago and I'm trying to use them to give me some lighting. My kitchen lighting, believe it or not, is actually really good because it's LED lights. I'll just flick the camera around and you can see them. I picked them up cheap. I uh, didn't imagine that I would use them for videoing, of course, uh, but there they are. Actually, let me try, turn, I'm going to turn on that light over in the corner. You can see there's a little light over there. I'm going to turn that one on in a minute, see if that makes a difference. I've bought some of these strip lighting as well. I'm going to throw that down the back and see if that makes any difference. So, eh, let's see what happens. I've uh, also put a light on down the side here just to give me a bit of uh, bit of light so I'm, I haven't got a big shadow under my chin. And I've got another light over here, like so. And so at the moment, I'm just trying to set myself up in a way uh, that will be effective. I've actually got three of those light, but one of them busted. So I'm gonna just see if I can get some sort of a, that's just too much, isn't it? So I need to push that one back a little bit. Let me play around and see how we go. I'm going to move that back. All right, does that look any better? It's a little bit better, still a bit bright on this side of my face. Um, and I'm not sure how to fix that. If you're a lighting guru, please give me tips. I would be real helpful in the comments down below. Of course, uh, we're continuing Tim Schmoyer's book. Day nine's up next. Uh, and that's all about uh, doing your channel and making sure that everything looks consistent and I'm still working on that. But today, today is just lighting. These lights that I bought a couple of years ago just been sitting in a box. And I thought, ah, I'm batching tonight, I might as well have a play with this lighting stuff. So um, these are 8,000 hours and I believe that their, their temperature is 55 can you see that? 5500K. So that's sunlight basically. So I'm going to whack one in the side here as well. I'll just show you here. We'll edit this. Throw one down the side. So I'm going to throw a bit more light on the left hand side. Here. But here we go. I'm going to pull this thing out of here. So that's what they look like. They screw in. I'm going to screw it into this side here. Let me see if I can get the video in a position where you can watch me do it. Now I suspect I'm not supposed to touch the the the, uh, the stuff there, so let's just screw it in like so. Good stuff. I'm going to plug that in. See if it works. May or may not. I did replace the switches in these at one point because they were really really cheap and uh, I thought they might have been dangerous so I went up to my local hardware and I bought some so that I wouldn't get electrocuted okay see how that looks oh that's bright let there be light I have one of these things that goes over the front of that to soften the light so I'm going to whack that on as well let's see how that looks I've got a lot to learn when it comes to video and how to do lighting and how to do uh, colour correction and the, the things like that. But I'll, I'll get there one step at a time. You know, finding my online biz, that's what it's all about. Learning how to do this stuff. Alright, so that's over there like that. So let's, let's go back to here and see how that looks. Okay, I've got a light in the background there, that's good. Uh, a friend of mine told me he didn't like the plant up there. 
in the corner. Yeah. I didn't put the plant there. But my wife likes it. So it's staying. <laughs> okay, so. All right, so let's see how we go with that. Now, I'm going to undo this thing. I'm going to put that in down the back behind my lounge over there. $15 at Kmart. It's cheap, 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 but it's, it's only to play with. You don't have to make things really expensive, just make them, you know, affordable initially. And then... Okay, so I'm pulling this out of the box. Comes with a USB cable, like so. USB-A on one end and a um, connector on the other here, like so. Doesn't come with a phone adapter to plug it into the wall, so you'll need to use a phone power supply, I should say. Two amps, I think, is the maximum you can have. Comes with the remote. Now the remote, the remote is cheap. I mean, it's flimsy. It's not very good, but what do you get for 15 bucks? So, little tab at the end, voila, I have power into the battery, and I'll need to power this up. So I'm just using an iPhone charger. The iPhone charger will plug into the USB-A connection. Then this connector here will go into the strip lighting like so. It can only go in one way because there's a there's a tab on it. Over back there, turn it on, let's see what it looks like. As you can see I've now got a little bit of light down the back. If I put some across the top, I've bought a couple of sets and we'll see how that looks. But we're getting there. And so I'm just trying to light up things so that I can do more videoing. I might be able to do some more videoing at night time because I've got to get up pretty early to go off to work. So that's, that's the plan. Let me know in the comments what you think. Uh, if you've got any ideas or about how to prepare a little studio like this, I have to be able to pack it up. But this is my lounge room, my kitchen. Um, at the moment, I'm, there's only a few of you, so I'm only talking to a half a dozen people while I learn this. So that's not a bad thing. Your first videos are your worst videos. So I certainly have a lot to learn. Well, here we are on day two, and I've put the light up the top, and I, the light's down the bottom, as you can see. Well, I know this has been a really long video, and I hope you enjoyed it. And um, I'm just putting these things together, trying to work out how to do this YouTube uh, channel. So if you enjoyed it, please like, subscribe and share. Hit that notification bell for the next time a video comes around. And until next time, enjoy the journey and I'll see you later. Bye.